Hi folks, Dr. Bob McCauley, my new and improved blood pressure formula. The reason I originally developed this formula was because many years ago I went to the doctor and uh, it was first thing in the morning. I just had a cup of coffee. So anyway, I'm kind of running around. My blood pressure is a little high. So right away they said, my gosh, we're going to put you on a high blood pressure medication, Prinipin, and that'll take care of uh, you know your problem and everything. Well, anyway, I went back a year later and they tried it and my blood pressure was perfect. And they said, hey, that Prinipin works pretty good. And I said, no, I never took Prinipin. I went back and I researched um, all the herbal extracts that are known to you know lower blood pressure and stabilize blood pressure and which ones really work well together, which ones re really work synergistically. So olive leaf extract, celery, celery seed extract, hawthorn extract, schizandra extract, black pepper extract. That was the original one. Then, since then, I've been really using a lot of natokinase, and I use it in some different products and everything. Natokinase is a systemic enzyme, absolutely amazing stuff. It removes fibrin from the body. Fibrin is like fiber. We see you have fibromyalgia. It's all this internal fiber. If you have any lung issues, you want natokinase. Um, but it also is excellent for reducing blood pressure. So you take about 100 milligrams of natokinase, and you're going to see that come way down there. So we added that to the formula. Natokinase just by itself will reduce your blood pressure anywhere from 10 to 20 points pretty easily. So by adding that to the formula, you really have something that really stabilizes your blood pressure extremely well. So if you've got high blood pressure, hypertension, this is the most common medical condition in the world, um, kind of common disease if you want to call it, hypertension. Um, this, is the, this is the formula for you, and it, of course you don't have to take any of these medications. If you want to go down that path, you go down that path. But if you want to stay natural, you can do all this stuff by yourself without medications, without drugs, all this kind of stuff, just by looking in nature and seeing which one of these herbs would really work and which wouldn't. That's what I did here, and it works really, really well. The other thing I recommend, and I, I put this in my last video, and I want to talk about it again, is deep breathing exercises. This alone can lower your blood pressure a good 10, 20 points really easily, maybe even more. But you got to think of your body as a balloon. So, and you're trying to get the blood out by, to the last capillary, way out into the very last little tiny thing out here, and push those out there because there's only so many blood cells in your body. So, if you look at a, uh, think about a balloon that is really not really all opened up all the way, you, you just kind of bl blew into it a little bit, you know, there's a lot more room there. And so, that's what you got to do with your lungs. You got to take your whole body. So, you outstretch your hands and you breathe in and you hold it. Now, don't hold your breath. Just hold it out there for as long as you can. Just keep kind of breathing in. And you do that for about five minutes a day, just holding it in and expanding it as much as you possibly can and just holding it. Don't hold your breath. Just hold it there and then relax very gently. You shouldn't get lightheaded or anything like that. But what that, what you're doing is you're expanding your whole body. It's what you put your arms out like this. You're expanding that balloon. So the blood has more places to go and the blood pressure will come down. And blood pressure, you know, hypertension is very, very dangerous. You know, you can get strokes, you know, heart disease of all kinds. So it definitely is a very serious thing. So between my formula, pressure release with the natokinase, I've added that now, and the deep breathing exercises, you can stay away from those nasty, terrible medications that don't do anything than just treat symptoms. Dr. Bob, see you next time.